Hey y'all, how are you? It's Erica and we're here with some Lip Sense color experiments today. So my goal for my lip is to make a seafoam green like muted color and after yesterday's experiment um, noticing how um, the rose petal matte here and this is true for any matte gloss it really really mutes down any shimmer shine or sparkle that comes naturally in one of the lip scents so I used this this is silver luster and everyone knows this is super metallic, very sparkly, gorgeous, right? But putting a matte gloss over it really mutes it down and turns it into gray, right? So I'm going to attempt this again using um, Ocean Gem, which is a very bold teal, love it. Um, and then topping the teal with the silver and then muting it with this rose petal matte and seeing what happens you know it it doesn't matter um it's all for fun it's gonna look cool no matter how it turns out so you know you can't make a bad mix that's pretty much with lip scents like it really doesn't matter you could pick three colors that you don't even think go together and you're gonna come out with a freaking killer, amazing looking color. So it's all about that blending, y'all. It's all about those layers. I might have some foundation on my lips. So, you know, I did my full face here. All Senegens products, you know. And now we're gonna do this lip. So the only thing I'm wondering is, do I do two teal, one silver? Or do I do one teal, two silver? I'm thinking two teal, one silver, and then this, because this ought to really mute this. And we don't want it too pastel. All right, you know the drill, y'all. Three layers of lip scents and then coat with gloss. I love this color though. One coat. Okay, gonna do another coat of this. This is a nice color, right? It's cool. Okay, just gonna touch up. Okay, got that all touched. So this is two layers. And next we're gonna do the silver.
to make sure everything's even. Okay, I love it. I could just leave it like this, really. That's nice. All right, we're gonna get it muted down a little more with this one. So, see how metallic that is? This is just gonna cut that all out. I'm telling you. Hey, that's kind of cool, right? This is different. I have never done that before. If you're a fan of matte lipstick, you're going to want to get these glosses. Now, this particular gloss here, Rose Petal Matte, actually comes as a duo with mauve velvet matte so these two come together in their own set a duo in a really really cute pouch here and you know it's so cute oh look i didn't even take the freaking plastic off of this okay so it's gonna come with this <laughs> it's all cute i love how they have like different um different zippers like this was the enchanted forest collection and it comes with this leaf um this one was so cool this is the earth element collection and it comes with a quartz like these pouches are spectacular so if you um order a collection you're going to be getting these two in the cute pouch which is awesome that's available on my website right now or you can message me and I'll put it in my monthly order for you. So what do you guys think? Um, this is just a really great demonstration of how these matte glosses can totally transform um, what a lip sense actually looks like. So even if you, if you like the color of one of the liquid lips, but you don't necessarily want the sparkle, the metallic, um, and all of that, just get it and then pair it with any of the matte glosses. So that's super fun. I don't usually do matte glosses. Obviously I do like sparkle and stuff, but I'm kind of digging these. Like I got this um, duo and I honestly really cannot get enough of these two shades they're both freaking gorgeous plus I mean how cute is the pouch right um, but yeah I'm just definitely really loving these mattes right now and um, I think it came out more gunpowder green than seafoam but it's all good all right, y'all, you let me know what you think. If you want to see me do a blend, let me know. I have every color, except my black ran out. I don't have my black again until I order again, but that's okay. Um, and if you want to try to make an ugly blend, I will test it for you and show you that no matter what you blend, it will still come out good. Um, I think I did this challenge a few years ago and it was tons of fun. We were like putting browns and oranges and purples together and it still came out fabulous. So yeah. Well, anyways, y'all, that's my lip look for the day. Thank you for watching.